going on guys, this is Joe Young coming at you with a, a review of video today. Today we are going to be talking about the Milwaukee Digital Refractometer. Alright, so like in my other review videos, I'm going to go over three things I like about the product and three things I dislike about the product. Um, and then I will give a general overview of the product as well. Alright, so I'm going to give a quick overview of the product. Um, if you are getting into a reef tank slash saltwater tank, um, you will probably need one of these devices. And so this is the digital version of one of these. You've probably seen in the store. Or one of these. So when you buy this product here, it just comes with the portable unit here, it comes with two solutions, which um, I seem to have lost, um, but two solutions, one to calibrate it and one to kind of read um, a salinity level so that you can see if this is calibrated correctly. And it comes with a couple pipettes um, where you can actually put in uh, the water um, solution into here. All right, so with the design here, it's just a couple buttons. So pretty much there is an on and off button. When you turn it on, it shows the battery life and what uh, what units you're measuring in. And so on here, it has three different units that you can kind of go through. Um, there is a zero button where you calibrate a solution and you basically say this is going to be zero. And the read button. And it also measures the temperature here because the temperature will also play into your salinity. All right, I'm going to do a quick test for you guys. And I'm going to show you how it works. So pretty much, you grab your solution, you put the solution into here. Um, the direction says, make sure there's no bubbles in here because obviously it is using lasers there to refract. And you basically hit the read button. And once you hit the read button, it will give you your salinity level. And that is pretty much it. The first pro of the product is it's super easy to use. Literally, you press a button and it reads the value to you instead of guessing where this is and or putting your your eye and trying to read where a piece of line lands this machine does it for you like I have no solution on here right now but pretty much if I hit it it knows that you don't have anything in there and it has a temperature gauge here as well so because obviously temperature does play into your salinity level but super easy, one button, that's it. Pro number two about this product is it's fast. So if I'm trying to measure the salinity of my water or a mix that I had, instead of you know going back and forth and placing a piece of, of water into here and looking through you know an eyepiece and making sure the bubbles you know aren't you know trapping the thing where I'm reading it wrong, I basically can just put the drop in here, press one button. It reads if I don't think you know that solution is good enough I can just quickly wipe this off put it in another drop into here and press the button and it reads again like I don't have to second guess triple guess you know do multiple things to make sure that I'm reading this accurately and the third pro uh, about this product is it's easy to handle um, especially if you buy this case that comes with it it does not come with the case you basically can put this in and literally it just opens like this and you can just hit on off right just one button place your thing and that's it you're good to go and also like you know once you're done you can kind of close this and you can grab it and go uh, with the other I guess the de devices that you would use like for example uh, this one right here um, you would have to you know play with some knobs to make sure it's fine-tuned make sure you don't drop it uh, make sure you know you're looking through a light source and um, it's just, you know, a, a little bit more of a hassle versus this. I can just throw this anywhere and it's good to go. All right, so what are some cons about this product? Well, the first thing is it's expensive. Um, it's about $100 for this unit versus $50. Or a cheaper version of this, which is $10. Uh, the second bad thing about this product is... It doesn't come with the case, obviously you have to buy that separately, which kind of sucks. But if you look at this, this is this is definitely a little bit bulkier than your normal, um, I guess, devices. So storage could be a little bit hard. 
All right, and finally the last con of this product is obviously it runs on battery. So at some point, I would have to re basically replace this battery. And um, I mean, it's a simple, you know, replacement. You can just open this up and replace it. Uh, no problems there, but it just kind of does suck that it does run on battery versus the other units where it doesn't require any battery and you can just kind of throw it on there and just use it. All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the review video. Let me know what you guys think about the product. If you guys are interested in it, um, I do have the link um, in the descriptions below. You guys can definitely click on that, check it out. And um, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Peace.